Android tablets are a sea of options, from the high-end full-feature tablet to the low-end sub-$100 tablet. There are literally thousands of different models to choose from, and two of my favorite that I've had the chance to use recently are the Nexus 9 and the Nvidia Shield. Both have similar specifications, similar hardware features, and most importantly to me, a stock Android build. Now, I've always been a fan of using stock Android tablets ever since I got my Nexus 7 back in 2012. Now, in 2015, I've been deciding what the best tablet is for me, the Nexus 9 or the Nvidia Shield, which is the better option. That's what we're going to try and decide in this video. I'm Ben with iTech Triad, and today we'll be discussing five reasons why the Nvidia Shield is better than the Nexus 9. Let's start off the discussion by talking about the speakers. Both the Shield and the Nexus 9 both have very good front-facing stereo speakers. Both have decent sound and since they're on the front, sound is much more enjoyable than on other parts of the tablet. This is a close call, but the Shield takes the edge for one main reason, the way the speakers are designed. The Nexus 9 speakers are completely open, which might give a slight edge in the sound quality department, but they also tend to gather dust far more quickly. Not only that, the dust is harder to get out. Meanwhile, the shield has a plastic guard over the top of the speaker, which prevents this problem entirely. So while the sound quality is just too close to call, the way the speakers are implemented is what gives the shield top billing here. Now in a move I didn't expect, Google decided to give the Nexus 9 a 4x3 aspect ratio on the screen. At first I was puzzled, since most tablets, including the shield, have a 16x9 or 16x10 aspect ratio. While it's not a problem, I feel that the 16x9 ratio is superior. This is mainly because videos are more immersive and that most apps are optimized for that ratio on Android. Now in the end, the screen ratio on the shield is just more practical, especially for heavy media consumers. However, if you like to read a lot, the Nexus 9 might pull ahead. Personally, because I value video and gaming a little bit more on my tablet, I have to give the edge on this to the shield. Now we can move on to the fun stuff. The Nvidia Shield comes from Nvidia, a company that is known for their work in graphics cards and processors. The Shield comes as a showcase for what their Tegra K1 processor can do, and it is really impressive. The highlight of the Shield's many gaming aspects, though, is grid gaming. Using the optional Shield controller, users can stream games from the cloud in full resolution and even stream games directly off their PC. No more are you restricted to just Android games. Full PC games are also available, and that's just plain awesome. I mean, come on, can you ask anything more than being able to play Portal on your tablet? Samsung has long been regarded the king of the stylus on Android, but Nvidia is certainly giving them a run for their money. The Nvidia Shield comes included with a stylus, which works incredibly well. While it's not heavy on the features, just the fact that you have a stylus for writing, drawing, or even just everyday tasks like reading, browsing, or navigating the tablet is a huge improvement. Meanwhile, the Nexus 9 has to rely on the more traditional capacitive stylus if you even choose to use one. Obviously, there's really no question who wins here. Now last but not least, let's talk about the price. Since I had the choice to own either the Shield or the Nexus 9, I had a choice to make. The decision didn't really come down to how much I was spending, but to how much I was going to get for that money. For the $399 on the Nexus, I got the tablet in its 16GB Wi-Fi variant in white. For $399 on the Shield, I got the 32GB LTE variant, and since I bought during a promotion, I also got the Shield controller and a few games. It's pretty easy to see where my money was better spent. When it really comes down to it, the Nexus 9 and the Nvidia Shield are both awesome tablets. They both have great things to offer, but it's up to you to decide which is the best for you. That's going to go ahead and do it for this video. If you want to know 5 reasons why the Nexus 9 is better than the Nvidia Shield, check out the first link down in the description for that video. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like and share it with anyone you think might find it interesting. If you want to see more videos just like this, please subscribe to the channel so you'll know first when we post a new video. As always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.